A lot of people don't know about this, but the built-in preview application on the Mac will let you do a lot of different things with photos. As an example, let's take a look at this picture of a cat. Preview will let you crop the image, resize it, adjust the color, and do a whole lot of other things. I'll show you a few of those. First, let's look at adjusting the color. Under Tools, you can choose Adjust Color, and you can see the shortcut is Option Command C, so if you need to do this a lot, you might want to memorize that shortcut. Here, this is the standard Apple color adjustment. So we can adjust exposure, contrast, saturation, which is the amount of color. You can turn a photo black and white by moving saturation all the way to minimum. You can change the tint and color temperature, and several other things. You can also make the photo sepia toned for an old time look. I'm just going to reset this. You can also blur the picture slightly or sharpen it. So there's one, there are some things you can do. This photo is really well done, so it doesn't really need any color adjustment. Another thing you can do is you can crop the image. You'll notice that it gives you an actual indication of the resolution of the pixel size of your crop. So if you need a particular size in pixels for a uh, website, you can do that. You can draw a box and then move it to choose exactly what you want to crop to. And then all you need to do is go to Tools and choose Crop or Command K. Then, if you want to resize the photo up or down, you can choose Adjust Size under Tools. Um, for pixels for web stuff, let's say we do 800 pixels. And there we have it. It does a pretty good job. Obviously, you, um, you can't keep upsizing forever without getting somewhat blocky, but that looks pretty good. And now I can actually use Save As. This is in OS 10.6. OS 10.7 does some other goofy thing. You'll have to figure that out. But I do Save As, and you can select a, a file format. So if, uh, if you want to save it in some other format, you can do that. Um, cropped, enlarged, and there you have it saved. Let's open the folder that's in, and there it is. There's our new file. There's several other features in Preview that let you do things like combine separate documents into one multiple page document. I might show those another time. Let me know if you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.